Let's now go across to India or New Delhi where Denmark's Prime Minister Mette Frederiksen is on a state visit. Denmark's Prime Minister Mette Frederiksen arrived for her three-day visit in the early hours of Saturday. She is now being formally welcomed at the Pavan in Indian capital. The Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi, External Affairs Minister S. J. Shankar and the Minister of State for External Affairs will be formally receiving the Danish Prime Minister. Prime Minister Mette Frederiksen is the first head of state to visit New Delhi in over 20 months. The visit of Denmark Prime Minister highlights India's increased engagement with the Nordic countries. In September 2020, both India and Denmark held a virtual summit and established a unique and first of a kind green strategic partnership. The partnership aims at cooperation and is also aims at green growth with focus on an ambitious implementation of the Paris Agreement and the UN Sustainable Development Goals. 
Denmark will also hold the next India Nordic Summit. Again, this is Denmark Prime Minister Mette Frederiksen. She is on a three-day official visit to India besides a meet with Indian President Korvind and Jay Shankar. And as you can see there, she has already met with Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Climate, energy, water and green finance will be on top of the agenda for the in-person summit. Well, today will be the main day of engagement with both Prime Ministers when they hold the talks. The visiting Prime Minister will also interact with think tanks, students and members of civil society. Therefore, I see this visit as a milestone for our bilateral um, uh, contacts and uh, for our cooperation. Last year, uh, Prime Minister Modi and I uh, were able to design and agree on a green strategic partnership. And today, uh, gladly we can meet here in Delhi to be more concrete when it comes to renewables, when it comes to wind and when it comes to water. And what we see is a very ambitious Indian government um, uh, who really wants to take a, a great uh, responsibility when it comes to the green transition in India and in the world. And I am very glad that we are able to have a cooperation uh, about uh, the green transition. And in a few weeks from now, uh, COP26 in Glasgow is coming up. And I also hope that we can use this fantastic meeting today uh, to agree on, on how we can support also the rest of the world. So I have great expectations and I'm very, very thankful um, for being here today. Thank you. Thank you. So that is the Denmark Prime Minister speaking to journalists there. There are more than 200 Danish companies which are present in, in India and over 60 Indian companies have a presence in Denmark. Both countries already have strong collaboration in the fields of renewable energy, clean technologies, water and waste management as the Prime Minister alluded there, agriculture and animal husbandry, science and technology and technology, digitization, including ICT, smart cities, shipping, and other forms of technology. Well, the Prime Minister is on a three-day visit to India, and we'll be covering all that for you.
Well, this is earlier on today. This will be the main day of engagement with both prime ministers who will be holding talks. The visiting prime minister, Mette Frederiksen, will also interact with think tanks, students and members of civil society. More than 200 Danish companies are present in India and over 60 Indian companies have a presence in Denmark. Both countries already have strong collaborations in the fields of renewable energy, clean technologies, water and waste management, as alluded by the Prime Minister. Agriculture and animal husbandry, science and technology, digitization, including ICT, smart cities and shipping. The Prime Minister is on a three-day visit to India and she will be engaging with Prime Minister Narendra Modi and the Foreign Affairs Minister S. Jay Shankar.